This is Twit. So I came back and Twitter said, three bucks, please. Twitter blue. Yeah, I'll pass. Done. I Done. Yeah, you and me. Uh, yeah, I subscribed. I don't, what did we get? I don't know. Yeah. Get <laughs> really? Three things. I get it. You get three things. Three things. You get, you get a clock on your tweet with a little uh, rotating so you can think t better of it. You can't edit it, but at least you can pull it back before it goes into But all that means is they just posterity. stop posting it. That's all they do. It. That's yeah. it. Two is it's scroll brought to life in that links to various publishers like the Washington Post from the Twitter feed will go there without ads. Doesn't get you around the and, paywall or anything, mm -hmm. but it goes to an ad-free experience for that story. And, some, and, and some of the revenue goes to those publications. Yeah. Oh, yes, absolutely, absolutely. Um, and then three is the return of a form of nuzzle. So hot news is whatever... Your the people you follow on Twitter have been tweeting. linking to. So that yeah. that's what got okay, me. That I would missed, be worth the three I miss Nuzzle. I was a yeah. huge Nuzzle fanatic. So sad when they got bought by uh, Twitter. So where do I go? There's a hot news. Uh, if you go to the there's a, there's a little fire on your on your left uh, margin. At least that's on the web version. Let me see what it does. Oh, on the web. So let me how, go on the web. How do I give them money? I haven't seen any. I mean, I've you seen have, the uh, news, uh, but I haven't. You go to your profile. Oh, I found it. Call, I just found it. it already. And you'll see blue there. It's called Never the top mind. articles. It's in the menu, right? Top so, articles. Um, okay. I don't know what I'm seeing. <laughs> this is why, to me, this is why I'm not a fan of Twitter. It's a little random. But anyway. Well, uh, if you follow Chris Saliza, you deserve what you get. I deserve what I get. You're exactly <laughs> yes. right. Top articles. Is this what you're, this is the new nuzzle is top articles. Yes. Okay. So these are. This uh, is because weird. people it's, I know. It's same, well, it's the same as mine. Yeah, because you know down. you scroll follow down. the same people I do probably. Scroll some more. I don't no, care about the breaks. Goddard School District ordering 29 books removed from circulation. I don't even know where Goddard is. How the media it's missed a New Jersey Senate candidate's racist social media posts. Uh, Malala got married. Okay. That's uh, nice. Yeah, it's nice. Uh, Mark Ruffalo and Jonathan Scott have electile dysfunction. Skip. Uh, real earnings summary. Don't know. CNN poll skip. 51 month sentence for QAnon shaman. Oh, yeah, that was an interesting. Oh, that's yeah, a big story. They're going, yeah. they're, they're through the, I guess that's what you call throwing the book at him. Mm -hmm. And uh, well, we'll see if he gets it, uh, if yeah. they get it. But that's what the prosecutors are asking for. Wow. So these are, so Wait these are, um, this is Nuzzle. You're saying it's, it's nuzzle not, limited to it's Twitter. It's not as yeah, it's not as good as nuzzle was because I had different things and but these are articles most shared in my network of people. Can I change? It's only last 24 hours. There's no there's no settings it looks like for this, but that's okay. I'm going to give it a try for a month. I love I mean, nuzzle for, I miss for having nuzzle like features. Yeah. That's worth three bucks. Well, to me, the best try. feature is look at my uh, look. I made my Twitter feed purple. And I have a new Twitter icon. Oh, How about that? that? Well, ain't now? that cute? That's worth three bucks by itself. <laughs> three bucks a month. Actually, well, I have I have good stories in mind. Oh, good. I have Chris Dixon on the future of crypto, although that's so old. The Verge's background policy, which good for that. I have that at the top uh, of mine. I don't even know why I care about that. The Verge's editorial policy. It's actually a really good policy. I we can talk about it if you want to. Or on background means but, you you're talking to somebody, but you're not going to quote them. Yeah, but, you know, a lot of times, like, I've been getting pushback, like, Amazon, Google are famous for this. They'll just, so on background, I'll, I'll bring up an issue. Right. Where And then they give you the most jargony, stupid non-answer. And I'm like, yeah. that's not effing anything. That's just, oh, it's so, so I, so I, 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 I clicked that, by the way, and now I got a special uh, on top, blue, Here's The Verge without any ads. Start reading. P.S. Ad-free articles doesn't include paywall access right now. So this is the ad-free version, which I'm getting anyway because I use an ad blocker. But still, I'm glad The Verge gets if some If they money. could incorporate paywall stuff, I mean, like, I mean, I have 50 million subscriptions. But for people, if I could subscribe to Twitter Blue for like 10 bucks a month and click on all the articles that I'm interested in, Ooh. that's actually a really interesting proposition. Would you, so you'd pay more if, the, if it were more complete, more comprehensive. I can't seem to well, put it into problem. I think normal people would if you pay like... Do you think normal people pay even three bucks for Twitter? If you could get access to the news articles that people are tweeting, yes. Because then it becomes like your gateway to all the media. Here's what your old buddy Om Malik has to say. <laughs> <laughs> this will be good. Oh, Lord. This will be good. He says, when you subscribe, I did 
You'll get additional ink on the right-hand menu that says Top Articles. I like the conversation panel that opens up when you highlight the article before clicking on the link to read it off Twitter. The ad-free readings thus far underwhelm me. There were three articles in my entire 24-hour Top News Articles timeline. Okay, so we obviously are getting more. Maybe it just hasn't, you know, kind of worked out yet. Notice, though, it wasn't just people we were following. It was people we were following divided by the the publications that would allow it to be ad-free, which mm -hmm. meant there was a lot of junk in there, a lot of chaff in there for me. Well, mine is looking okay so far. It's pulling okay. up a lot of college football stuff because tis the season for me. Ohm <laughs> says, despite the shortcomings, I'm willing to try this new offering at least for six months. After all, like most of us, I don't want to sign up for individual magazine or newspaper subscriptions. I surprised that Ohm does See? not, because you He's and like I me. do. I mean, it's yeah, but I mean, if you think about it, I pay probably I pay at least a thousand dollars a year in subscriptions. Me too. So New York Times, well, Washington but, Post, The Atlantic, The New Yorker, uh, Bloomberg. Bloomberg. It goes on. Like you know, I, the information but alone still, is four hundred bucks a year. I stopped that. I got rid of the information this year. I, I found Bloomberg way more interesting and relevant. For Bloomberg's me. expensive. It's even more, but it's worth it. It's 400. It's the same as the Is it the same? Oh, okay. Mm. Yeah. I was paying the monthly, which is like 39 bucks. Ooh. Ooh. After all, but, the bigger you know, question, Ohm writes, remains unanswered. What percentage of 397 million Twitter users will pay, this is my question too, will pay $36 a year for these premium features. I think people in our business will. Yeah. It won't be yeah, easy. I think it's, it's a hard. small thing. Yeah, it's hard to get it's people to pony thing. up for yeah. something they perceive they've been getting for free. Tell me about it. I know all about that. Nevertheless, Twitter should stick with it, says Ohm, because in time people will start to see value in this premium upgrade. I think so. And if they get enough people who matter, so journalists actually matter, you know, you know, you reach journalists on this platform and you can push stories, right? Um, who will then write about your stories. You could see some sort of like media subscription come from that. And that's worthwhile. Or Twitter also has their newsletter thing. So maybe as an individual newsletter person, if I write something really awesome, I would love the chance to get a little bit of money from people reading it, you know. How how would Instead this affect the Substack people? people? Subscription. All well, of the, unless Twitter did a deal with Substack. Yeah, how would it affect all of the independent folks out there using Medium and Substack? Well, and let's whatnot? say if I had a publication and I charged people five dollars a month for it, and then maybe some, and I had this, and I was doing it through I can't. What is Twitter's newsletter platform? Does anyone remember what they bought? No idea. <laughs> okay, mm. whatever their platform is. Um, if I if I had my regular subscription base, but then I did something that's a little bit more general interest and people mm. wanted to read it, I could maybe click a button and Twitter would make it available through that and they could share some revenue back from the virality of it. Mm. That would be really interesting Look to at me. what uh, Aaron Rupar is doing on Twitter. It's kind of interesting. He did, uh, he's a, a journalist, just started- he's, He is great. He, he watches all the Fox News stuff and the Trump stuff and everything else and pulls up the videos. He's, he's invaluable. So He watches so you don't have to. Twitter is a perfect oh, okay. medium for him. He just started a brand new newsletter. So he tweeted the Rittenhouse trial, live tweeted it, and then said, I'm tapping out for now, but if you appreciate it, check out my newsletter. For him, there's a lot of value. Yeah. Uh, Twitter is kind of the perfect medium for what he, what he did with that, right? He is perfect for that because he pulls videos of everything and and makes it terribly shareable he's he, aaron is is uh, he deserves battle pay for what he does uh so we all don't have to watch what he watches but he's great hmm. but will this pull people off of facebook for their news you think no twitter to, to me twitter is a very specialized audience i mm -hmm. mean 300 some million people tells you right there Mm -hmm. Compared well, to three I mean, and a Twitter half is far billion. better for me for news yeah, than it's, Facebook. I, agree. I don't get news from Facebook. Yeah. we're the exact. I don't get news from Facebook. No, we're the exact audience for Twitter, but that's not not a big. And that's audience. fine. Well, mm -hmm. but that's listen. That's that's it, it, what's gotten us in trouble is scale for scale's sake, scale for scale alone. Okay. To be as big as possible. I agree. And, I and agree. This is where oh, this is why I, I get so excited about things. Project Blue. But see, right? to me, Twitter's not niche enough. <laughs> well, that's why blue matters. Not, okay. not this blue, but the blue sky matters. Because, you know, if the, if the speech layer becomes commodified, but the curation, selection, confirmation, authority layer 
becomes selective and you can pick who you want to to find just the stuff you want, then maybe, maybe Mirable Dick 2, you'd stop complaining. Wouldn't it be interesting if somebody explained what Mirable Dick 2 means? No, I, wouldn't it be interesting? <laughs> no, I know what it means. Wouldn't it be interesting? Phoenix Warp suggests this, I think. He's saying it may also filter out the crap on Twitter, just like our Discord. No one's going to pay to troll and just tweet out crap. But right now I'm seeing stuff from people who pay and not pay. Wouldn't it be nice to have a setting that said only Twitter blue people? Then it really becomes I a think niche. they might get there. That, I think that, that's yeah, what you got to wait to get nice. enough. Yeah. Right now it's 10 people. That's definitely maximizing. <laughs> it's just it's 10 it's just, people. It's just me, it's Jeff, not 10 people, and Stacey. It's like 100. So yeah. It's 11. Well, and, and Tony Hale, Tony Hale alone <laughs> is worth 2.99 a month. Yeah. Tony was the founder of Scroll and Chartbeat before that. Oh, they so he, bought okay. They bought Scroll, there. and I've been seeing that's one of the benefits of Twitter Blue. What is Scroll? So Scroll was intended to say to publishers, uh, "You're losing people. You're losing money to ad blockers. You're never going to get money from them." Uh, what we can do instead is we can offer a, a group subscription, basically, where somebody can come in and they'll get an ad-free experience, legit, and you'll get a cut of the revenue. Tony never said it was going to solve every problem of the news industry, but it was going to be helpful. It was going to give them money they weren't getting. And so, but he, trying to get all the publishers to sign up was was torture. So uh, he got a lot of them, but but still. So then Twitter bought him and, and acquired him, his brains and his team. And they included that scroll-esque feature into Twitter. But again, all it does is give you, I already subscribed to the Washington Post. Mm -hmm. So I now get a page without ads to the Washington Post. I actually be fine with the ads to the Washington Post. They're not awful. I don't subscribe anymore to the Atlantic because it overdosed me. Um, and, and so if I go to the link to the Atlantic, I'll still hit my, you know, two a month and, and you're done, bub. Uh, but I'll get them without ads. This is definitely getting better for me. The more I scroll, um, it's just you just more. turn it on. Yeah. Yeah. It's definitely getting better. I'm seeing, of course, I see a lot of Twit content on there, but I'm seeing a lot of tech news in here now. In addition in the, to in, in the um, top stories from top me. articles. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This is, this is so much better. So there's something on the right of top articles. I guess that scroll conversation. Oh, I don't know. I didn't even look at that. Yeah. Oh, I guess that's a. Oh. Oh, no, that's cool. Oh, Harry that's McCracken, for each article. So Mike click on an article per and article. You'll see the conversation about the it. Conversation. Oh, dude. That's that's something that Nuzzle did not have, and I kind of like. Yes, this. it did. Yeah. Yes, yes, Nuzzle. You could see. Well, you'd see all the um, names, but you wouldn't see it scrolling like this. But this is much better. Yeah, this is good. This is oh, good. This gives you some context. Oh, yeah. It gives you some context. I yeah. Mean, here's Jason Howell. So I tweeting about it. I do feel like. <laughs> This is cool. an improvement uh, in the it Twitter is. experience. Um, so, so far, I don't mind spending. So the good three on bucks. them. Good on and them. It's a, it's a it's a nice price point, three bucks a month. Yeah. Ah. So far, I don't mind it. Uh, I mean, the Washington Post subscription for me was about the same price, I believe, because of Prime. Oh, four bucks a month, I think, four fifty or something. And I got Prime, nothing yeah. out of it. But this is so much more meat. Now here's now what another, happens. Like the Washington Post, I got nothing out of that subscription. I would pull it up, and it was it was almost like doom scrolling. Everything was just I'm sad kinda, news. I'm a little disappointed you by know? the Washington Post too. I agree with you, but uh, individual are I wouldn't. But I don't do that for the Times either. Just go to their site and scroll through it. But I, I pay for it because when individual articles show up in the other feeds, right. then I want to be able right. to see that uh, without a paywall. Mm -hmm. And I, so they come Leo, up enough in tech meme and other things that I, I, I'm going to yeah. see those. Yeah. So, Leo, scroll down on the left side until you find uh, Washington Post or uh, Verge, one of those. Under, top, blue under bar, top articles? Under top articles. You'll see a blue bar that says ad free with Twitter blue. Yeah, right here. There. Yeah. So yeah. click on the article. Click on the article. Okay. Because you probably have an ad blocker anyway. No, we already did that. Oh yeah, absolutely. We oh, did that already. I was. Yeah, I remember that's why I was showing you the pop up that said. Sorry, you're I lost my internet free. for Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so he was tweeting. He was. <laughs> no, I wasn't. I was screaming that I just spent a. By the way, how do I look in one gig? Uh, good. Good. It's actually better, isn't it? He's, it's nice. he's still yellow. He's not as well. No, no he was pink before. No, so that's, you that's, can't. You can't. <laughs> that's one gig, much better. One gig converts <laughs> you to yellow, which is good. It makes a lot. Of stuff. I think yeah. those of us who pay for one gig would prefer to call it gold. Gold, but uh, <laughs> daylight's balance. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Um, so no, I didn't, you look, I, you look I, good. You're smooth yeah, and the good. frame rate's good. But you're saying you dropped out. Can you out? dance for us? 
Yeah, dance yeah it, dropped, it dropped out. They were supposed to give me eight boxes to replace my boxes. I got two of the eight. They're supposed to come Friday. They're now saying, Friday, whoever told you Friday, no Friday. They're supposed to do all this last Tuesday. They didn't do much of it. I'm screaming on the phone, but... Hey, I look better. <laughs> I will say. Oh, was when, that you screaming on the corded telephone? Yes, Show everybody that, that in case they forgot what you those You have a corded like. telephone? That thing was awesome. Just pick that up. It was like. Holy cow. Oh my God. Isn't that great? <laughs> Where'd you get that? Was there an antique store in uh, that's Bedminster? New, what that's the hell? thumbnail. This is my wow. landline, children. My <laughs> landline. Landline. <laughs> what is this? Want to so, hear this weird thing? Yeah. It's called a dial tone. Boop, boop. <laughs> so I will say Twitter is still the place to go for customer service. How would you figure that? Well, oh, yeah, I just did that with I just did that with 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 Lisa. We had oh, I got you. when yeah. Tesla we so it was Solar City. We got our solar panels from Solar City. Now a Tesla company, mm -hmm. and we didn't know it, but at the time they installed decorative triangular solar panels that aren't actually solar panels. And you can see, this is a picture. The regular solar panels look fine, but the one, the co the cosmetic solar panels are starting to look terrible. Yeah, yeah, that might be a problem. So we called and called, and they said they've, that's how we found out they're cosmetic, but then we never heard from them. So finally, Lisa tweeted the next day they came and took them. Yeah, so, I agree with you on that. If you want something done, tweet yep, them. Yep. And that, while Elon Musk is busy uh, destroying his stock with you know, Twitter. So that was, that was pretty good. They could do two things at once. I thought that was impressive. Very impressive.